Hey guys, it's Paul here from successandwealthcoaching.com. Alright, today's lesson is, who is your client? The whole point of this is to find out exactly who your client is. Because you need to know who your client is for targeted marketing, alright? <clears throat> the whole goal is to save time and money, alright? And once you know who this is, it'll make it very easy to find. And <clears throat> why would I say to this? Because when I talk to people all the time, they don't have a clue and go, Oh, it's just someone that needs me to come and do a job for them. Or they were just walking past and that's not very good if you look through your profiles we'll know exactly who your ideal client is who they are when they are and when they're going to want to use your services all right <clears throat> so the whole aim of the, this next five minutes is to tell you how to find out who your ideal client is so how do I find this out <clears throat> well first of all we go and talk to our past clients that's pretty obvious and that'll give us a profile what was the average spend with you okay and we can use a thing called Survey Monkey. And the last one, when they come to the counter, if you're at a fish shop, for example, you ask them, why'd you come here? And all that. Okay, let me just give you, I'm going to show you a sheet in a minute that I've done up for you at the bottom. Right, guys, if you go to the bottom of the page, you want to be able to download this two-page sheet here. It's basically a questionnaire that you want to answer to find out who your ideal client is. So let's go through. What is their age? Okay, they might not give you exact birth date. They'll probably give you a ballpark. We know whether they're 20 or 50, won't you? Are they married, divorced, or single? Male, female? Where do they live? How much do they earn? Probably not going to tell you that, but you'll know exactly what they are. So you guys, we scroll through. There's a heap of questions here you can go through. I'm not going to go through each one here, but you get the idea? Whole idea, once you answer this over time, it'll give you a ballpark figure of where they're coming from. If not exactly, my client is this, 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 lives in this suburb, earns this, is divorced, married, single, etc. Alright guys, so nothing else download this and fill it out every month all right guys so you should have downloaded that form by now and that should go in your marketing file all right let's for example <clears throat> got a little friend out in um, Adelaide <clears throat> she does um, fit out she tidies up cluster and makes it into organization okay I'll give you a profile about her later on but she knows that her ideal client is female between 41 and 49 mum has two kids lives in the middle suburbs as a house worth 450 might be renting might be owning but she's time poor flat out has got spare money is happy to pay for someone to come and clean up the man cave that he's not going to do or more importantly one of the key requirements was that she wanted a craft room back because the kids are now off to work and she's working part time how's that for a detailed example of who you'd want to be marketing to all right so how are you going to market to them facebook ads everything you're told there you can nail it right down and that will save you a ton of money um, using that profile we just gave before school mums how much is going on there soccer mums where they hang out Saturday morning at soccer pretty easy to find cafes where do they all go they all go to lunch don't they you can all see them and at 2.30 they all run away to go to pick up their kids from school they're on Pinterest they're up there posting up pictures of the nice house they want to live in and where they want to be alright so how can you target it? Well, you know the suburbs are in, so you can letterbox drops. They're pretty easy to spot. You know, you're not going to be in the little house commission areas. And yeah, you can move your way up to the um, top end areas, but they're probably in for a super designer. They need the swanky um, office the office or wardrobe fit out. Um, simple flyer. Flyers I love. They cost you next to nothing. Easy to do and very easy to test. Um, and last of all, referrals. Where, how many referrals do you get off? Past clients, locals, neighbours? offer a reward um, shops where, where does your product sell <clears throat> and, and when can you put an ad up saying it's all too hard to do this for example um, I don't know fish tank shop they could offer a service where they'll fit out for 50 bucks more we'll do everything for you put it in there clean it up um, wash the gravel put in the right pH level set um, fix up all the little funny things on the pumps because the gut the, the dad might be too busy at work but he wants it for his kid the next day or Christmas Eve or something. All right, what else? <clears throat> cross joint ventures or cross refer. All right, real estate agent. He's going to come and sell a house. Every time he comes to a place, goes, you need to go and drop a flyer at Mrs. Jones's place because a fantastic house, but she's got two junk rooms. Go and fix it before I can sell it, and I tell her it's worth an extra twenty thousand. She just needs to spend one or two thousand with you, doing a nice wardrobe fit out because it's a six to seven hundred k home but it looks like a 300 400 because it looks like a junk room um, the shoe shop where all the women buy their shoes from 
I mean, yeah, you can go to the best and worst place and buy the $20 shoes, but if they're spending two to $300, do you think they'll want them looked after? They'll know who their A1 clients are. Um, <clears throat> and because they're mums, school gift baskets. Next time the local school is putting on a raffle, go and donate something. Make it a big prize, put in there, and I guarantee the local principal will go, hey, I've just got a hundred bucks worth of XYZ from such and such um, closet refurbished, and they will do it for you. Okay? And do you think out of it, I don't know, my school, my kids go, there's a thousand kids, so that's like 500, 500 women. Do you think at least you're going to get one or two sales out of that? I'd hope so. All right. Do you want to learn more? Guys, go to my website. Download a, this report or one of the other marketing reports I've got on there, how to help you. Or if not, if you learn a heap and you want to learn more, talk to me soon on, on um, Facebook. Thanks, guys. All right. That was a...